in these problems, we need to find the measures of some line segments. And we're being given some of the measures of some of the other line segments that make it up and some information about midpoints. And we need to put all that information together uh, to figure out the answer. These can get a little bit complicated. So I'd recommend definitely filling in as much information as you can on the diagram. Or if there isn't a diagram, making a diagram uh, to start with. In this one, we have a diagram. It says G is between E and H. Well, that's certainly true. And F is the midpoint of EG. So E to G, I want to remember F is the midpoint. I'm just going to put this up here like this. And here's our midpoint. OK. And then it says FH equals 11. So from here to here, we have a distance of 11. And then it says FG, aha, uh -huh, that's this part, is 8. And we want to find EH, and that's the length of the whole thing. So first of all, if FG is 8, that's half of this piece from E to G, because F is the midpoint of E to G. So this part over here is also 8. So that's the first piece of information I can get there. And then I know this is 11, so this little piece right here must be 3, because it's made up of the 8 and this little part here. So that has to be 3. So now we have all the information we need um, to add up the whole length here. I could take 8 plus 11 or 8 plus 8 plus 3. Either way, it equals 19. Let's try one more like that just for practice. It says S is the midpoint of RT. So let me just draw something in here so I can remember that. S is the midpoint of RT. And R is between Q and T. OK, if RT is 12, aha, so this whole distance here, RT is 12. I'm going to take a moment to, to break this apart, because I know that then this segment is 6 and this segment is 6, because S is the midpoint. And then it says QS equals 8. So this distance here is 8. And that means this little chunk here must be 2, because 2 plus 6 has to equal 8. And it says find QT. That's the length of the whole thing. So 2 plus 6 plus 6, that's going to equal 14. So that is a little bit of work with segment addition and midpoints.